What it do, flight crew? FTC. Flight team stand up! Why you lie is July. Hey, you guys, we have the Brooklyn Nets versus the San Antonio Spurs. As you guys know, Kyrie Irving thinks he's better than everybody else, so he decided to skip out on the NBA bubble. He decided to cut class. He decided to cut school. He decided to say, hey, I'm better than everybody. I don't got to participate in the bubble. Or maybe he still is trying to consider, um, you know what I'm saying, other things. I don't know, man. Or maybe something's going on. I don't know, man. But very disappointed to see Kyrie not playing. Very disappointed to see KD still not playing. How is KD not able to play? You had all this time in quarantine, buddy. So the Brooklyn Nets are left with absolutely nobodies on their team. Who else plays for the – Danza Russell don't play for them no more. Like, nobody plays for the Nets. The Nets have literally nobodies. San Antonio Spurs, they got uh, DeMar DeRozan. No, they got a couple other uh, – you know, players. So I'm expecting the Spurs to win this. Check it out. I literally do not know who the Nets have, bro. Oh, they got that Josh Childers Jr. dude. They got that Joe Harris dude. They're both casuals. I only know Joe Harris from 2K. He got like a 95 plus 3. This is the first time the Nets are playing or what? Because I ain't seen him playing in the beginning. Lavert got them struggle braids and I see him. It's a scrimmage, but it took a lot of positives out of it. Lonnie Walker. That Looney Walker, dude. To play at this Josh Childers Jr. passing the ball off to Harris, it looks like. Okay. That's Harris's shot, though. Bert cut off, trying to make his move on Murray. That's silky smooth. And just getting used to the environment, the circumstances, the floor, the sounds, the lights. I think we're seeing some of that impact the Nets here early on. Hurdle, the spin, the finish. Got That's three more hours in his contract. Had to make a layup, huh? Half court set here for Brooklyn, 11 8 lead. Levert, fake, Hezzy, deuce. Didn't that Levert deuce for like 30 or 40 points in the season before it got cut off? Murray drive and pull up. Book it. It's that DeJounte Murray, dude. He's trash. He's a lucky shot. Very smooth delivery. Great boy. And Derek Wine drains the Trippers at their first lead of the night. Yo, imagine being a Nets fan, bro. Right now in time of day, bro. It has to suck. Oh, I forgot. They got Rudy Gay. But Rudy Gay is not an all star no more. He's washed up. Derek Wine. It's an old head. Look, he's getting ripped and everything. Was that even him? You know, there was trade rumors that Zach Levine dude was supposed to go to the Nets, too. That would actually be a fucking bomb-ass team, bro. Zach Levine, Katie, and Kyrie Irving, bro. It changes the whole dynamic exactly. of what they can do offensively and whether it's a five out. 37-36. Spurs. Lane opens up and Jeremiah Martin. Got a five day contract player making lips. Anywhere he wants on the floor. Fade away. That was ugly as hell, bro. How are you in the NBA doing that shit? Yo, did you see this man's shorts disappear? Hey, DeRozan, buddy, you're an all-star. Are you going to score anything? You're supposed to be the leader of the Spurs, DeRozan. You can tell DeRozan's, like, literally sad playing with the Spurs, bro. DeRozan can't even be himself. Greg Popovich tears people's souls away. <laughs> when you play with Greg Popovich, bro, you got to play like a casual. You got to play like a, a fundamentally sound player. Greg Popovich was like, DeRozan, you only able to do windmills three times in a season. No more flashy play style for you. That Looney Walker, dude. Nice shot. Josh Shortis Jr. Ew, why does that Levert dude shoot like this? You see that shit? What the hell was that? Oh, Josh Shortis Jr. getting ripped. DeRozan, you get a score, buddy? Man, Looney Walker taking off, man. Oh, that dude is trash. Nobody player. 
against New Orleans the other night. We have 7.50 to play in the third. It felt that way. It Hallelujah, DeRozan. Imagine being an all-star average in 20-plus points per game and you're scoring shit in the scrimmages. Oh, he's hot. Karras Levert is feeling it. He won three-point attempts for Brooklyn. They've made 10. Looney Walker, dude. Looney Walker, dude, he got a shot on him. Temple goes back to back. Temple didn't take the three, instead drives in. Scoop shot goes. Garrett Temple. Justin Anderson understanding where the clock was at needed to get it off quickly. Three points. Bird. His ability to play multiple different positions will also place him as a player of the Jeremiah Martin had it blocked. The Nets lead is down to eight, and it is Johnson on the end here. It's cut it to six. Johnson gets to the cup. Count it and a foul. Talk about Johnson's play. Tyler Johnson, that is, but 6'3, 6'4. Slam down. I always think you have expert <laughs> knowledge. That's lead by six. Martin on a kick. Deep one. Anderson drills the triple. Right, nobody player making a curry like range three. Off the deflection, ball movement leads to shooting practice for Bellinelli. What's that Bellinelli, dude? Bellinelli's a trash casual. He's a casual, but he's trash enough to not to be. He's too trash to be called just a casual. He played for the Raptors, I remember. He used to have a glitch three point shot in two, one of the two Ks. He's probably had like seven jersey sales his lifetime and everything like that. Brooklyn 101 to 99, San Antonio. Now 103, 99. 103, 101, excuse me. Rudy Gay, are you going to do something with the ball? Damn, Rudy Gay is such an old head now, man. He has no more explosiveness. Like, if Rudy Gay was at his prime how he was back in the day and he was playing in the Grizzlies, bro, Grizzlies have to be a title contending team, low key. The hell? Thomas fakes on a three. Drives in, scoop shot. That was ugly as hell. Thomas, three point lead How was he even in the NBA? Look at his body figure, bro. His body player build, man. He looks like a silver refrigerator protector, bro. No, no cap. He looks like he'll protect, you know what I'm saying? All the um, chips of oil and shit in the cabinet. <laughs> Brooklyn 116, 113. San Antonio, pull up Biddy. Two point game, buck 42 in the quarter. Nobody play with the uh, Mitty. Crazy, man. All the bench warmers getting all the clock this uh, week, and they ain't going to be touching the floor at all this week, man. Could it be me? Brooklyn is a winning 124. That's sad, dude. Like, bro. Bro, like, Brooklyn literally has two casuals on their team that are literally playing right now, bro. You know what I'm saying? You got one player that was an all-star. He's a casual now. It's Rudy Gay. And you got the other dude. You can either say that Levert dude or the Josh Hooters dude. Like, and San Antonio was losing. San Antonio has DeRozan, the Looney Walker dude. Like, so many other threats on the floor. Uh, Rudy Gay, like, bro, like... Damn, dude. <laughs> Basketball in this generation is just sad, bro. Hey, man, that's usually me. Coming up with a little extra. Two days, man, on the road to three million.